Hey, so what's up guys? Matt here with TechDroid. Back again with another video for you guys. This time it's an unboxing of the Huawei Nova 2i. But I don't have just one unit, I have two. One in black and one in gold. So without further ado, let's slice open this package and see what it looks like. You should take it so I'll be unboxing the black one. So let's remove the top of the box. And right on top you can see the SIM ejector tool as well as the Nova 2i. So let's slide it out of its packaging. Okay, let's put this to one side and let's get into the rest of the contents of the box. So in this small package, you can get it out. We have some instruction manuals, quick start guide, which you probably won't read, as well as warranty card and a free hard plastic case. And you can hear from the sound. On the left side of the packaging, we have the mentioned SIM ejector tool. And if I'm not mistaken, should be the Huawei charger. Micro USB cable. As well as some headphones. So let's put all this to one side. And get to the main star of the show. Which is the Huawei Nova 2i. So a little bit about the tech specs. So this phone is powered by the latest mid-range chipset by Huawei, the Kirin 659. It's octa-core processor with 4 Cortex-A53 cores clocked at 2.36 GHz and another 4 Cortex-A53 cores clocked at 1.7 GHz. It also has 4 GB of RAM and 64 GB of internal storage. So on the front, we have a 5.9 inch IPS LCD display with a resolution of 2160 by 1080p and a screen PPI of 407. So above the display, we have our regular proximity and ambient light sensors as well as the earpiece and the dual camera which is rated at 13 megapixel and 2 megapixels. On the bottom of the display, we have our Huawei branding. To the right side of the phone, we have our volume rockers as well as our power button. On the left side of the phone, we have our hybrid SIM slot which can hold two nano SIMs or a micro SD and a single SIM and capable of 4G LTE. On the bottom of the phone is where our 3.5mm headphone jack lies as well as the primary microphone, micro USB port as well as the speaker grill. On the rear we have another set of dual cameras, 16 megapixel as well as a 2 megapixel camera for depth information, a fingerprint scanner and the flash. Towards the bottom rear of the phone, we have our Huawei branding as well as some CE certification. On the top of the phone is absolutely nothing else except the noise cancellation microphone. So with the specs out of the way, let's power this on and go through the setup process real quick. So finally we are done with the setup and uh, we are greeted with the EMUI home screen. From first impressions, I can say that the screen is pretty good. Viewing angles are decent. And um, this full view display really makes the whole front of the phone look very attractive indeed. At this price point of 1,299 ringgit, or translates to about 300 US dollars, this is definitely a goal. This is definitely a worth it investment, especially in the budget category. So guys, this wraps up our video for today. If you did like this video, smash the thumbs up button and please subscribe to this channel for more content just like this. Let me know in the comments what you would like to see in my next video. Thanks for watching and peace out.